And men try to flip the script and say, oh, well, well, women in my phone, they're not giving me any money. Well, hello, sis. Toot, 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 toot it up. The Next Door Podcast. Welcome back to The Next Door Podcast. I am Bestie Next Door, and I'm like your bestie next door. If you like your tea to be extra, extra sweet, then this place is not for you because we like our tea to be sweet and bitter. Sweet enough that it goes down bitter enough to wake us up now guys this is not a new bottle of wine i had this bottle of rose wine on one of my previous episodes i just didn't finish the bottle so it's halfway finished anyway so i might as well finish it for this episode because we're gonna get into it on this episode for smr sakes let's pour it up first sip marvelous 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 on this episode we're talking about why women should have only reliable male contacts when i see this on my tiktok on my social medias people come at me but i still stand on what i say as a woman you should only have valuable male contacts because you know what a man will have a contact list full of women on his phone knowing who to call when he wants what when he wants to guap guap 300 he knows who to call when he wants someone to cook him a meal he knows who to call. When he wants someone to Netflix and chill, he knows who to call. See, women nowadays just like to have a whole bunch of contacts just to have the good morning notifications. But no, I want valuable contacts that I know that if I'm in need of something or if I need help, they can help me. If you're a man and you are in my contact list and you provide no value, you are a waste man and you are going in the trash where you belong. There's no point of having a male contact in your phone that's just texting you saying, hey, good morning, what you doing? He's not your therapist. You know what he's after. He's not providing no value. Next caller, why is he in your phone? He's taking up iPhone storage. Block, 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 and delete. Only valuable contacts. Because all the men in your phone, they're only after one thing, and that one thing is what you have in between your legs. Use that to your advantage. You know that all these men that are in your phone are after one thing, that you only need to have valuable contacts because what you have in between your legs is valuable, clearly. Why are you having male contacts in your phone that's just texting you what you're doing, good morning, like he's a therapist, but he can't text you how much you need? It's expensive to be a woman. A man just needs a haircut, a good fit, and he's good to go, but we need our nails done waxing eyebrows lashes hair it's expensive to be a woman and men try to flip the script and say oh well well women in my phone they're not giving me any money well hello sis toot 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 it up since you're looking for women to give you money toot toot you better be ready to bend over why would you as a man expect women to be giving you money that's demasculating a man giving a man money that's demasculating him and how can a woman respect you if she's giving you money at that point toot toot you better be ready for that plastic toy if she's paying your bills valuable contacts because if you go through a man's phone he knows who to call for what you can't be having male contacts in your phone just taking up storage and not offering you anything besides good morning and what you're doing i'm pretty sure the guys that are in your phone texting you good morning what you're doing he's probably texting five other girls the same exact thing out of all five of them it's only one of them he's actually doing things for and if it's not you next caller block and delete because the more you waste your time you're going to get used to seeing his good morning notifications men know how to play the game so good that a man will chase you for so long and you You've been playing him and the moment he finally gets you he's gonna play you so instead of him playing you know how to play the game valuable contacts only don't have the guys that's chasing you for years and just because you want to boost your ego and because you like attention keeping them in your phone don't keep them in your phone because the moment they checkmate you game over because you're gonna fall for him and he's gonna play you harder than ever they chase you they chase you they chase you and they'll say you know what since she keeps giving me access to chase her the moment i get her game over i'm gonna make her cry blood that's why if you're not interested in him and you know he's not even offering you anything besides trying to chase you for whatever reason next caller don't even waste your time don't even give a man an opportunity to play you most of the time when those men are consistent there's always that one time where a woman becomes vulnerable and say you know what let me just give him a chance because he's been chasing me and i'm just lonely and i don't have anybody else to talk to don't be that don't allow the man that's been chasing you for years to still have access to you don't allow it if you know where it's heading cut it off don't even give him the opportunity to try to checkmate you just because you want attention. Get attention somewhere else, but not from them, not from waste men. That's why I preach about listening to the High Value Woman audiobook, because when you listen to the High Value Woman audiobook, you start acting like the woman that you want to be. A lot of women fail to understand that. The woman that they are today and the woman they want to be is just a thin line. In your life, it's, it always takes that one day. One day you can be a millionaire. One day you can be heartbroken. One day you can fall pregnant. One day you can be madly in love. It's just that one day. 
who are you going to be? Are you going to be the woman that, you know, I want to change, but, 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 or are you going to be the woman that's taking the change today and saying, you know what? I'm tired of what I'm attracting and I'm tired of what I'm currently dealing with. And today's the day I take a stand. There's a thin line between what you have and what you want. It's just all about you putting your mind and setting your mind to do it. And I'm going to give you guys an example. I want to say two years ago, I tested the ability of mind. I went three days with no food, no water, just to test how strong and powerful the mind is. And can you believe that because I set my mind to achieve it, I actually completed it. I didn't break because I told myself that this is what I'm going to do. So I'm saying all of that to say that whatever you set your mind to, you can accomplish. If you are saying to yourself, you know what, I'm tired of attracting the guys that I'm attracting and I want to start attracting better guys, trust me, you will. But you have to make that change. You can't be the same person that you are that's not a woman of value and think you're going to attract valuable male contacts. You need to become a woman of value in order to attract valuable male contacts and valuable interactions. That's why I say listen to the High Value Woman audiobook. Become the woman of value. We're not doing the city girl and the hot girl no more. No, we are high value women. And let's cheers to that. Guys, thank you for watching and thank you for listening. Guys, you know I tell y'all anything but a lie. If you're looking to get the audio book or you're looking to get the course or book a one-on-one -on -one with me, the link is in the description box below. Guys, like, comment, subscribe. It truly helps my channel and turn on the notification bell to be notified when I upload any videos. If you're listening on Spotify, thank you for listening. Guys, you know the rest. Until we meet again.